Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create an Instagram Reel in Canva. Before we start, hurry up and check out all your software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, for you to create an Instagram Reel here in Canva, what we need to do first here is to basically access our Canva account. In this case, go to canva.com, access your account or lock in. Now from here, what we need to do is we need to look for a template that we could use for uh, Instagram Reels. But in this case, if you want to do this manually, you could actually do this by clicking on the create design at the top right here. And basically, we want to go to custom size. Now we now need to know the size for an Instagram Reel. So in this case, by doing a simple Google search here, you should be able to see the size for it, which is typically around 1080 by 1920. Let's go ahead and go back into our Canva account here, enter our width as well as our height here, which is 1080 by 1920. And in this case, just go and click on the create new design. Now, you should now have your look here. Now, what we need to do now next is to basically start organizing a few things here. So in this case, let's go ahead and uh, basically change our look for our Canva here. So in this case, at the bottom here, if you do already, if you don't see your pages here, you want to click on the show pages option and you want to click on duration so that you'll now have a video format for your editor. Now, in this case, we want to start adding our videos. So in this case, you, maybe I want to go ahead and upload my own videos. So for example, I want to go to uploads here. I want to go to videos and I want to go ahead and open up a folder that I could actually uh, put some images. So in this case, let's go open up our uh, file here. So maybe I want to add one uh, video here. So for example, I want to add this one. Let's go and drag it in here and that should upload the video itself. So in this case, in this video, what we need to do next is to basically drag it in here. Let's go and drag it into our video. Or in this case, what we need to do next is we now need to make sure that this actually fits our whole canvas. So in this case, you want to go ahead and resize it as you can see right now. Uh, if you want to make it like, for example, you want to have it uh, look like similar to this one, you can go ahead and do that. And you can just click on the actual background here and change the color if you want to example I want to use this one but yeah so in this case the next thing you want to do is you want to proceed with the customizations as you would so for example if you want to add some text you could go ahead and do that as well so as an example I want to go ahead and just a few things maybe I want to zoom in a bit here and I want to go to text at the top left here or left panel here and I want to go ahead and add our in this case our text so for example I want to use this one so in this case maybe I want to say uh, this is going to be save and let's just say it is going to be the next one. Let's go ahead and select our text here. And from here, just type in world. So in this case, you do whatever here. You can even add animations to your text if you want to. Let's go ahead and click on anime here. So make sure to select your text first. Go to anime here. Maybe I want to say I want to make it fade. Now, once you've done that, let's go ahead and add our second video. So in this case, we want to click on the add page at the bottom section or in our timeline here. And I want to go ahead and go to elements. So maybe I want to go to uploads instead. Uh, yeah, so let's go to elements here. So maybe I want to add a, another video that we could use here. So you could actually go to search elements here and just type in video. So you should be able to see different elements here, but you should, you should be able to see the option that says videos. So go and click on see all here. And maybe I want to use one of them. So for example, I want to use this one. Let's go upload it in here. So in this case, same thing. You might want to all right click on it. So in the actual video, right click on it, and maybe I want, you want to go and click under place background if you want to, and basically have it uh, zoomed in, as you can see right now. You could double click on it to change a few things if you want to, or uh, why not. But also, if you've done something, you could go, go you could go and click on Control Z to change a few things. So if you want to revert that, you could go and do that as well. So, for example, I want to change the the background itself. So maybe I want to choose, or I want to choose the option here for our color. So maybe let's go ahead and add a new color here. Use our drop, our picker, color picker here. Maybe choose this one. Let's go and resize it. And yeah, in this case, you can go and do whatever you want here. Add your text. So it actually depends on your taste or how you want it uh, designed. So for example, maybe I want to say this one, but 
beware if you, it actually has like a crown on it this is going to be the pro version for canva so you won't be able to necessarily use it on your uh, templates or your designs here unless you have the pro plan but since we don't have that let's go and avoid that so maybe you want to actually use this one but again this is just an example you can go ahead and double click on it change your text if you want to but yeah for now we are good with this one now by the way at the bottom section here you can adjust the time for your videos so let's go ahead and adjust this one so maybe we just want this to be in two seconds the other video is going to be let's just make it like two seconds as well or maybe let's make it three seconds to make it a lot longer but yeah so in this case you could go ahead and uh, adjust a few things here but what we need to do next is we now need to add our transitions now in this case you want to go to your first page here and your second page go to in the in between sections of them now it should show you two options here you have the option to add another page but you also have the add transition option let's go and click on the add transition now you could choose whatever transition you want here so for example i want to use the circle wipe here or the dissolve option so you could also choose shop so maybe i want to use the flow here so make it a lot more seamless so in this case that would add our transition so whenever we play our video here it should give you that transition here which is now our in this case our reel or a reel that we could upload now also you could add your own music in here if you want to so you could go to uploads here go to audio and basically upload them in here so in this case uh you could drag it from your folder like what i did before so maybe i want to use this one let's go ahead and drop it in here and from here what we need to do is you just need to play it if you want to now you could adjust a few things like the beat sync option here, add some audio effects. You could adjust a few things if you want to adjust it to a specific time instead of the very start here. But yeah, so once you've done that, what we need to do next here is that we now need to basically uh, export or save this. So in this case, you could save this via your PC here, but you could also save this on your mobile phone. So in this case, let's head over to our mobile phone. So we are now in our mobile phone. So in this case, you need to install the Canva app here. So if you haven't downloaded the app itself on your mobile phone, just go ahead and open up Google Play Store here, look for Canva and you should be able to install it. But in this case, go open it up and I should now be logged in. So the UI itself is kind of similar with how you use Canva on your PC. So no worries on that. But in this case, let's go ahead and access our most recent designs here. So since we just created this one, it should be the first recent design here. But in this case, that should show you your design. Now, in this case, what we need to do next here is we want to go ahead and basically save this. So you should have the option to save this by clicking on the uh, share button at the top right here. And just click on download. And from here, you could choose MP4 here, choose your pages or what pages you want to basically use. But in this case, let's go ahead and click on download here. And that should download. Let's go ahead and click on allow and allow or let's say, let's go and click on allow here but once you've done that what we need to do next is just basically wait for it to download so this might take a while so in this case let's just wait for it and let's go ahead and head over to our um instagram account so in this case as you can see it's already in our gallery let's go ahead and go back into our phone here let's go access our gallery and you should now be able to see your video so as you can see this is our video here so just to give you an idea let's go ahead and play this one and let's go ahead and click on allow and allow all and it should show our video here and the demonstration itself and yeah so guys let's go ahead and head over to our instagram account here let's go ahead and open up instagram and from here, what we need to do is we need to click on the plus button here and want to go to the reels option. And from here, let's go and choose our video here. You could, you could adjust a few things here. Let's go and click on try it. If you want to add some other things here, add your custom musicians if you want to. But once you're sure, just click on next here. And from here, again, do your custom musicians if you want to. But let's go and click on next and let's go and click on share. So once you've done that, you should now have your reels in to your account. So this might take a while since it's going to be uploaded, but from here on, you should be good. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.